what's up y'all mr totem back again now y'all remember the last time when i was painting the wall inside right well you know i got bored again y'all y'all remember this one right bing bing right well i decided to do another one like i said i always get busy or sometimes be even bored and just say, all right, I'm just gonna paint something. Check this out. Excuse the mess. Bam, how about that? finished a couple of koi fish on this side a really angry tiger on the other side well the tiger is actually a dragon tiger a little hybrid of uh, Japanese mytho mythological mythological history uh, he's over there growling <laughs> now I think it's pretty cool when you really look at it it's more like a it's more like a print in the background a little bit, right? It's like, uh, kind of like a texture, right? And what I did was I had a can of gray <laughs> and I already had a middle gray wall and I just didn't feel like it was jumping enough. So over here in my little, uh, workshop I'm like you know what I think it needs a little something so a little bit of gray a little bit of pink you can get this guy going and uh <laughs> what you think huh yeah we're big on the Japanese aesthetic here I think that's one of the coolest things about adding the tattoo style on the walls is that the classic Japanese cars that are parked in front of it or even some of the American cars, when they're parked in front of it, it really showcases it from every angle like a, uh, a portrait, like a, a nice photo. And it really, really brings it out. So, what did I use? Well, I used some Cobra Gray. Which gray is this? This is Banhoff, the the gray of, of, of Ban, I guess, I don't know. But, so I used this gray and I actually mixed a bunch of black and white into it. So 
little bit of a little bit of other odds and ends of colors I used um, and of course a little cobra black and I highlighted the areas off of the middle gray the highlights basically step it out step it out a little bit more than just the straight up gray and when you put when you put the, the middle gray as a rolling color down first it, it kind of keeps it solid like okay this is basically the medium I'm gonna go ahead and start adding larks, uh, darks and lights and uh, the hot pink is the pop color right you gotta love gotta love Sakura like that beautiful pink is just nice to look at and uh, yeah that's literally that's literally all it was. I got bored and I said, you know what, I'm gonna pick up a couple cans and spray something. And uh, <laughs> this is what ends up happening.